Hey, what's up guys? iRot here. So we gotta get working on the iRot Horror Buddies Series 3 sticker packs. It's already April and we only have until Halloween to get them done. So that's about five months. They take a long time, so we gotta get going. If you're new to my channel, I have a character that I draw named Bud or Buddy. His general shape kind of looks like this. I just cut this out of cardboard and I use this as a basic template when I'm designing so that I can keep my drawings the same size and shape. But every year on Halloween, I release a brand new sticker pack that has five unique characters inside. The first sticker pack I released was on Halloween 2014. That was the iRot Horror Buddy Series 1 sticker pack. And this was based off of horror themed characters from movies. Those characters inside were Buddy Krueger, Buddy Voorhees, Seed of Buddy, Hellraising Pin Buddy, and Franken Buddy. Now again, that was Halloween on 2014, and last year for Halloween was the iRot Horror Buddies Series 2 sticker pack, and this was based on zombies. So the zombies that I had designed were Vicious Vic, An Infection, Mel Practice, Study Buddy, and Manuel Labor. And so for both Series 1 and 2, I didn't really show much of the design process for these. I had some speed art videos that showed me coloring these on the computer, and then I even have an unboxing video which kind of shows you when I receive the final prints in the mail. But this year I'm going to take it a little bit further, we're going to show you the whole design process from beginning to end, that includes basic sketches to the coloring on the computer, making these top cards, and then receiving the final prints in the mail. Now I'm hoping that along the way I can share some tips and tricks, so if you guys want to create sticker packs on your own, hopefully this will help as a guide. In addition, I want to keep it open so while I'm designing Series 3, if you guys have any cool suggestions or ideas that I could incorporate, leave them down below in the comments and if they work, I'll incorporate them into the design. So I have chosen a theme for Series 3. The theme is going to be a freak show. And I actually came up with this while watching the television show American Horror Story. They have a freak show season in which they have really cool characters. There's a creepy clown, a conjoined twin, a lobster boy, and a bearded lady. And I thought, how cool would it be if I create a sticker pack with my own freak show? So we're going to do just that. The first character in line is definitely going to be a creepy clown because you can't have a freak show without a creepy clown. So that is the first character. The other four, I'm not really sure yet. So if you have any ideas, leave those down below and uh, we'll definitely consider them. In the meantime, I have some sketches already completed that I'll show you guys. And then at the end of the video, I also have some speed art videos for you too. Okay, before we get to the speed art videos, I just wanted to quickly share some of the first sketches that I've done for the clown character. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on this, but when I design my characters, I like to start off by filling up several pages with sketches. Sometimes I even add notes on the side. I don't usually put a whole lot of effort into these sketches, primarily because none of them are supposed to be final. I'm mostly doing this to explore some of the different ideas I have for the characters. And you'll notice that I draw on in individual parts rather than the entire character all at once. Because sometimes I have to draw an object over and over again before I'm happy with it. So it's sort of like a puzzle. At first I just draw the pieces and then later on I put them all together. If you'd like me to go into a little bit more depth with this process, let me know what you think down in the comments below and in the future videos I can spend a little bit more time covering that. But for now, I just wanted to share some of the most preliminary sketches with you. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the speed art clips I've put together. In any spun house of fear! 